well, you know, money is tight for people now, inflation with groceries. It's like, and the least you could do is be eating healthy instead of eating that. Like I am legit absolutely in shock that a Dor bag of Doritos is $7. I legitimately remember Doritos being like four something, 485 and I thought that was expensive. $7 for Doritos. Are they out of their minds? Like, so I just got to Publix and I'm gonna do like a healthy like food haul. I've been feeling kind of irritable a little bit lately. I think it was kind of triggered by something that happened the other day. Um, I learned that someone that I know of has unfortunately stage four cancer. And this kind of just like put me into a weird frame of mind because I went through myself an entire year of being screened for cancer. It makes me emotional just thinking about it. Um, so I went through an entire year of screenings for cancer, which thank God came back benign. But like, it just kind of like triggered me and I'm feeling kind of almost like PTSD effects from everything I went through and the screenings and you know, the way they had to like go into the tumor to like see if I was okay. And I think that that's kind of like what's happening right now. So I've been kind of like spooked by this and I'm just at the grocery store and I'm gonna do like a healthy haul of healthy food to kind of just feel like I'm taking care of myself. Um, I'm just shopping for healthier items. I've got, I've got spinach, kale, cucumber, finally found one that wasn't rotted, uh, mushroom, peaches, carrot. So I'm gonna make a salad, but I'm also gonna make like smoothies and stuff to try to like get healthier. I got spinach, kale, mushroom, a cucumber, peaches. I'm gonna make it like a salad, but I'm also gonna like start having like smoothies more. I'm going to get peaches, cause this is good for me. i get a few peaches. Two peach, take two. Is that one okay or does that look weird, that one? You know? Oh, Christ. And I'm not saying like these groceries are cheap, but the whole point is that like, if you get them instead of getting chips, obviously that that is, cheaper than you know doritos How, did you know that a bag of doritos are seven dollars now the cucumbers are like normally rotted i don't know if any of them look okay they all look pretty bad they always look kind of awful you found one you found the cucumber that one is okay we're gonna get fish instead of shrimp we just think it's probably a little bit healthier so we're gonna get this fish i don't really like salmon i think it tastes too fishy I'm gonna get this fish. I've been really liking this blueberry pomegranate drink. It's really tasty. I mean, of course, if you probably go somewhere with like Whole Foods or something like that, maybe you could find better quality, but I don't think this one's too bad. And it says it's organic. So I've been really liking this one. So I'm gonna continue to drink and get this. And I drank it up really fast the last time. I don't know how healthy this stuff is but i like it and it's healthier than probably eating chips and i tend to get the wasabi flavored ones because they are a little bit easier to tolerate especially like my palate you know wise i like the spicy food i don't really like the sesame flavor one so i got a dressing my juice orange juice seaweed i was going to get uh the asparagus but it doesn't really look like it's fresh so probably gonna avoid that the cut okra in a can is on sale again i know if i knew how to cook it that would be better but you know again better to get this than doritos obviously i keep referring to doritos because that's like the weakness but we'll we'll get this so olives and then quinoa however you pronounce that I'm sure there's a way to cook it yourself, like not from a box, but I don't know how to do that. So we're going to get it from a box. So I've got the start of salad ingredients. I was going to get onion or tomato, but unfortunately it all does not look good. It hasn't looked good in a really long time. So we're going to skip that. Um, we'll see what else we can get. I don't really, I don't really feel in the mood for like berries and stuff. But it's not just the inflation. You realize that, you know, this is $7 and there are ingredients here, yes, that are expensive, but in reality, the entire package of fish is $6, $6. So there you go. And 
you know, your impulse purchases are, are not cheap. And, and reality is this entire section is like not exactly hot girl summer vibes. Okay, so I'm getting some raisins. I was able to get this garlic package, whereas the, like, the individual ones all seem to be rotted. And I'm getting some walnuts. I didn't even realize that Doritos had become this expensive. So on sale, it's $5. I don't even know how much. How, did you know that a bag of Doritos are $7 now? Huh? And then you get tempted and you need your, your toppings, your salsa. And it just becomes like a slippery slope. And it's not like, oh, like, why are you complaining? It's like, well, you know, money is tight for people now. Inflation with groceries. It's like, and the least you could do is be eating healthy instead of eating that that i know i'm here like making a youtube video but like i am legit absolutely in shock that a Dor bag of doritos is seven dollars i legitimately remember doritos being like four something 485 and i thought that was expensive seven dollars for doritos are they out of their minds like seriously i have all of these healthy ingredients which are not cheap ingredients you know you buy kale and salad ingredients it adds up but like a bag of Doritos, like that's the entire point. Like you could have kale or you could have a bag of Doritos. And these foods in theory look very good, but in reality, we know that these things are not, are not good for us. Like you just like, you know, this is upside down. Oh, there you go. I was like, oh, that's not a, it's like, that's a lot of stuff. And I just want to be healthier. Get that one. Get that one. It's on sale, so. Okay. Get some mushrooms. You know, when we talk about like impulse purchases, like a lot of times my go-to was to like get a slice of this cake or something like that. And even if I was splitting it, we know that this stuff is not obviously good for you. It's expensive, and um, you know when you talk about like healthy eating with inflation healthy eating with inflation if you don't buy these cookies which who knows what's in it because that's a whole lot of ingredients so i'm getting stuff that's like good for like a salad kind of zoom out the cart so that people can see i'm getting stuff that's good for a salad but also a smoothie because i just want to like try harder you know and also yes there's inflation and those, these ingredients are expensive but like so is buying a bag of doritos so that the TV dinners are kind of a false sale. It's really bad chemicals. Even if there's a sale, it's like how much food can possibly be in like a little box? You're better off buying eggs and eating eggs if that's all you're you're dealing with. You know, this is this is not good for you, this stuff. That this type of stuff, and they even like advertise it like balance. It's supposed to be like good for you. It's like half the fat that comes in a box. It's like, okay, no. This is the treat item I usually go for. It's supposed to be like an organic pizza, but it's still fattening and I'm trying to avoid it and just like stick to like healthier options. I try to avoid, you know, saturated stuff right now. So this is like the only butter that is non-GMO. So I'm getting this one here, particularly the yellow one. And it's very expensive, but that's something that I kind of feel like my system needs right now. Okay, so we got eggs, the butter, what else did I just get? Oh, I got cheese. Where's the cheese? It's the organic one. I was gonna get the other organic one, but it was like, I don't know, it didn't look very happy looking. So I'll get this one. And now we got banana, and I'm sure it will be expensive. We are now attempting to check out. So just checked out. The total was about $85 which is which is obviously it's expensive you know for groceries you're not like buying just eggs but uh you know if you eat it over days because you can't even eat all of these groceries like in one day you know it could probably comes out to maybe like 20 dollars a day for eating healthy so i'm gonna try to like see how long these groceries last but at least i feel like i'm trying harder and again like number one i go i go through stages like where i eat super healthy and then i don't eat as healthy and then I kind of got spooked with this person that I know of that became sick. So I'm gonna just try to like eat a little healthier and maybe that'll kind of, you know, in a way help my mind a little bit. But um, I appreciate you guys tuning in and I always try to be like super honest in these videos. Like 
I don't want to be like a fake blogger. So if I'm feeling like irritable or something like that, or I'm going through something, I don't think there's anything wrong with being the type of content creator that tells you honestly how I'm feeling instead of trying to like sugarcoat everything. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you soon in my next video. And bye. I am home. I want you to know that I ate my seaweed in the car coming home. It was wasabi flavored, it was spicy, and I liked it. Thank you.